Hey guys, it's TTL back with another rush kit for you. And today we're going to be taking a look at two new Crucial Ballistics memory kits. We've got the Tactical and this one is the Elite. Now they both come in four and eight gigabyte sticks and in that you can get the variations between uh, up to 32 gigabyte. Now they, they both come in eight and gigabyte kits in 2666 and 3000. Uh, but with the Elite, you can get another kit that is uh, 3,200 megahertz, but they are only in four gigabyte sticks. So there's a mix between the two, but let's have a look. And we'll talk about the specs and all that type of stuff as well. I hate blister packets with a passion. Right, so we have this one. Now this is a 32 megahertz kit and Essentially, what we can see is that we've got 16, 18, 18, 36 at 3.5 volts. I would say that they've got kind of a water-cooled kind of look to them. This big chunk at the top looks like it could be a uh, like a water cooling block. But these sides are actually quite thin. You can see that you've got the thin wraparound that goes over the top. And then this is actually screwed. There we go screwed in and then it all this actually holds the sides on they've actually got a very light feel actually it's a very different uh, kind of feel to them where we've got these gaps I'm trying to see underneath but we can't really but i think that's got a kind of quite um uh, and it, like i said an industrial kind of barely military look to it i'd say this looks more tactical than the uh, the tactical does anyway we've looked at one we will look at the other Okay, so moving on to the tactical, this is a 3000 megahertz kit. And what we can see here is 15, 16, 16, 35 at 1.35 volts. Although you could see with the uh, graphic that we put up before. Now that, when we turn it that way around, you can see it's got a very thin profile at the top. This almost looks like it belongs in a key ring. These actually feel very light as well they are metal don't worry it's not plastic they do feel quite light i'm actually trying to see how they are fixed together but i'm assuming they're just bonded to the the heat sinks but it's a very i'd say this is quite a minimal look i think they probably got the um in my opinion i think they've got the name in the wrong way around but they all look quite nice but obviously it, it can, they can look very different when they're in a board Okay, so we can get a look at it in the board, and I've got it in an X99 board, so you can get the gist of what it would look like either side, but obviously if you're just running Z170, then you're just going to have it on this side. It's all pretty simple. It does look incredibly chunky, I think is the best way to put it. The dims are very thick and square looking. I definitely feel like that's got a tactical kind of almost military kind of feel to it, I think. Um, I, the chunkiness as well, it, sound, it might sound like I'm saying that's a bad thing, but I think it's just got a really nice kind of rugged is probably another word that we could use, you know, thick and burly kind of look to it. It's much different compared to the other ones. Now the tactical have a totally different feel to them. And in, when they're in the board, you can see straight away, they're actually quite minimal and understated. I think that gunmetal gray is lush absolutely looks the nuts and we've got it in an asus board here with the white but i i can't help but think that this is making me think msi titanium so msi titanium board i actually think now they are still quite understated and it's amazing that they uh, end up understated on a board that is basically gray and silver but i do quite like them I would say that these are my favorite out of the two that I've shown you today. And it's mainly that really thin profile because it's almost like there's not a memory stick in there. But then when we turn it round ever so slightly, yeah, I really like the look of those peeps. Really like the look of those. 
Anyway, so they come in multiple uh, capacities, so eight and four and eight gigabyte sticks, and you can obviously buy uh, different speeds as well. The uh, 3200 megahertz is only available in the Elite. 2666 and 3000, I think they're both great looking, and they are the, um, the Elite, I think, would look great in something like an Asus Sabertooth, maybe. These, an understated system, uh, maybe. This was just, the greys was just what made me think about these, but a grey system, understated system, maybe a black system, I don't know, but I do really like those. So, two great looking kits, again, from Crucial. Uh, so, yeah, this is Tiny Tom Logan with another quick rush kit for you, out.